The climate legislation that uh, we worked on in the Senate was extremely interesting and just 20 years ago uh, this month and uh, that was the single most important statement of scientists that in fact man's impact on the earth could be measured and was real. Uh, now of course we have to look ahead 20 years and what the next 20 years are going to bring. There are four areas in which we can really move and move very aggressively. If you look at climate and carbon, it breaks up into a third, a third, a third. A third transportation fuels. We can certainly make automobiles much more efficient. We can have a different kind of automobile. The bioenergy is extremely important, has to be done right. We have similar challenges in the utility industry. We have to get the utilities to really think very differently, to focus on energy efficiency first and foremost. We have to think about building standards and the way in which all of us live day in and day out, how we can do a much better job individually and how we can really change uh, the nature of the industry. The final issue that I would note is of course the population issue and that is uh, neglected by people usually because it's too hot politically, uh, but it's one in which we really have to be very honest about the future of the world and the future of the world. Uh, today we have six and a half billion people are going to be probably eight and a half to nine billion people on the globe by 2050, that magic date in which we have to reduce our carbon emissions very dramatically. Well, to all of you at UNEP and to my fellow champions of the earth, my apologies for not being with you. What all of you are doing related to the globe and the future of the globe is so extraordinarily important. With each passing month, each passing year, we learn more about the urgency of the task which you all have taken on. And I, for one, want to join in thanking you for your very good work, uh, for all of us together urging ourselves on. We have to do that. It is a task that's going to take all of our energies and all of our commitments. We still have a ways to go, as does every country. But I think uh, we still have a chance to turn the corner before uh, real chaos and catastrophe hits the globe.